What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome to another Pokemon Sword and Shield VGC 2022 team builder slash showdown live slash it's it's gonna be one of these like chaotic videos where I, me, Brady, and a third person, usually Michael, but Michael was unavailable so we have a special guest for you today. Uh, we just get on here, we team build around something ridiculous and hope to do our best. Uh, but yeah, uh, Brady, you know, you, you're a regular in the channel, say hi I guess. Yo, it's good. <laughs> and we got a very special guest, long time, like a long time coming. Honestly, I meant to like ask you to collab, and this just happened to happen today. Uh, but we got Neil VGC, top ladder warrior at the moment. Honestly, insanely good content and very good tips on this channel. But yeah, say hi, Neil. Hello. Really excited for this. Hopefully, we build something really saucy. Yeah, saucy boosted but it just dawned on me that we don't have an account yet so we'll, i'm gonna cut back to when we have an account set up for all three of us okay. real quick uh neil i'm gonna let you pick brady and i right. get brady and i here's 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 a fun way to choose neil toss out three pokemon and brady and i will both strike one pokemon and whatever's left we're just gonna do that okay uh first pokemon volcarona oh second okay pokemon. second pokemon cinderace and third Pokemon, let's see. I want to go with Howlin Flame. So okay, so you're, you're real into fire types today. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, Brady, I'll let you strike right. first. Oh, I don't leave it up to me. Um, you strike first. Oh, I'm gonna strike Volk. Volk, all right. I hate Cinderace of the Passion. Congratulations, we're gonna build the world's greatest talent flame team, except for that one that just top cut um, Vancouver. Uh, but yep. honestly, I, I like talent flame a lot. I've you it was actually like the first Pokemon I used to top cut a VGC tournament in like 2017. Um, and I, I think it's still kind of viable, but viable in the way that it's tailwind is faster than Whimsicott's, but then Whimsicott's just gonna tailwind the next turn, so. Yeah. There's um, a way to get around it. What was that? There's a way to get around it. Isn't it just like sharp, sharp beak? beak full wing beat. Yeah. That's a, yeah, you know, I kinda like that. So yeah, sharp beak, tall wing beat, tailwind. Hard. How do you it also gives you priority air streams as well if you if you want to do bad. That's true. Yeah. Do you think how do you, how do you feel about Will Wisp on, on Talon Flame? It's good. So you either go a uh, expert belt with like dual wing beat and overheat, or you just go straight Willow as quick guard. Um. Hmm. If you go with the quick guard, you probably just want to play ogre. Yeah, I th I think that's actually uh, but, a smart. Um, I I, I really like the Willow on it. Um, Willow and like Willow is like decent because like yeah you're faster than thunderous you're faster than like mer everything that isn't as ocean dude i wish yeah, dynamax like, wasn't a thing because faint would actually be so cool yeah but so like sad. this format kind of hates we can faint do guard. yeah quick guard's really good yeah and like uh mainly to block glide but mm -hmm. and also yeah. like versus ver in in like situations where we have like a kyogre next to our town flame and there's like a you know a grim snarl across the field you know, quick guards actually be really nice for like blocking scary faces and thunder waves. Yeah, and then um, wait, are we on recording right now? Yeah, we're already recording. Okay, okay, just making sure. Uh, so Kyogre, we can. Uh, so there's two good sets for Kyogre. I think either Assault Vest or Life Orb or even Mystic Water. We can yeah. go with either one. Usually, what I like to do is just like get a skeleton going first and then fill it out as we go. Yeah. So I, I like Kyogre. The second restricted. Um, I mean, we could just play like standard like Kyogre Zacian, uh, but I mean, like we could we could also you know change it up a little bit. Bar is good. I mean, we did see Kiram White Town Flame top cut a tournament. Like that's a thing. That yeah. is wrong. I mean, we could we could just play hyper offense today. Why not? Like that's that's, that's the thing good. that gets you to the top of the ladder on Showdown whenever you know you want to <laughs> just climb fast. Uh, I I, yeah. I kind of want to go I kind of want to go Kiram White. You know. Let's Garen do it. White. Yeah, I'm down. All right. Yeah. So we no got <laughs> jerk quaking in his boots. Yeah, no. All right. Yeah, no. Here, <laughs> Behold the Joe UX9 counter. This is for <laughs> this. This counters your Groudon and this counters everything else. You're yep. Oh, God, dude. Rest in peace. Just 
I, I, I don't, I want to make like a video talking about Kiram and how it's like the worst best Pokemon in the format. Yeah. yeah. Like it, it, it oh. on paper should lose to so much, but if even one person is prepared for it, if you're even mildly prepared for it, you just beat it. It's just like, yeah. but if you you're not, you win, like you're easy. White tech? What was that? Mm? Do you want to use the secret Kiram white tech? What is it? Helping hand. Oh, <laughs> and we just do we just drop protect for that because we still get max guard. Yeah, and yeah. then you pair with Legilecki. Oh, in physical life orb Alecky. Either set. Essentially, the goal is if they want to fake out your cure, like your Alecky, and then remove the Kirum, you can just helping hand max the Alecky kildization. Essentially. Yeah. I saw Paul type. use it with NPA. Uh, what you dragon like, move do they help. usually run on Kirum? I honestly have never seen yeah, the dragon. Media? Is oh, it Meteor? I'll like Draco because it's a really good, like, just straight nuke option because your other two moves are kind of weak. Or they're not weak, but they're not, like, strong, you they're, know what I mean? They're very mid-power because, yeah, you got stab on this, but what are you at? You're at 105 base power, yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, and, and we then, run the only Kiram White set that should ever do be we wanna used. Run, do we want to run Lob or do we want to run, like, Sash so oh, we can or, take one Behemoth Beard? We could do Belts. Oh. I mean, because we... Or did, 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 did we want uh, Life Orb and Alecky? No, Magnet Alecky is yeah. like, enough. We can go uh, Life Orb Kirim. You always want the damage on that Mon. Yeah, and then, like, if Magnet you even Alecky. like it, because if something lives a Kirim hit, your Kirim dies. Yeah. Okay. And then I think logically the next Mon should be Rillaboom. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, Rillaboom looks hot on here. And then we get a nice little AV Mon like there. Yeah. Um, I mean, what is it? We got Townflame, Kyogre. Kyurem, Reggie, like your Rillaboom. Um, we see. we do kind of bad under Trick Room if we end up in that situation. I don't want to see Amoongus because it still loses in some situations. Oh, Amoongus, um, like, well played Amoongus. Like, if your opponents know what they're doing versus Amoongus, like, you kind of just get bopped. Yeah. 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 Okay, hear me out. Mm. We may be playing Hyper Offense, but I get one stupid idea per video. Yep. All right. Yeah. All right, you ready? I, I am give it ready. Over. We are not losing to Calyrex. <laughs> <laughs> I refuse to lose to Calyrex today. This is this is my dumb idea. Yeah. I got is, there, is there is there a better steel type? Yeah, <laughs> no, that's, that's 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 a very bad idea. I'll, I'll be honest. I'm I'm gonna retract that immediately. You want to know the solution? What? It's actually Snorlax. You got thick fat. Ooh, that's an option. That's true. That's true. Um, but but consider the following. Uh, what's his name? He's so irrelevant. I forgot his name. <laughs> Slower than Calyrex. Actually, wait. Isn't it a speed type? I think it's, it's a speed type. Speed type, bro. It's a speed type. All right, check it. You know, he's already steel type. Let's give him some iron. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> you know, a lot of Calyrex don't actually go min speed, but I assume on ladder people will do that, so. Yeah, just to be safe. I mean, it gives us another fake out mon, and it, it's good for the thumbnail. <laughs> used, like, and dude, this is just like another like episode where we have like an initial guy that we want to use, and then we just get a different person. Yeah, different, what, different what was mod, it last like, time? It was it was it was, uh, in, it was in ten or two. Yeah, we wanted to use Kingler, and then it ended up becoming the physically defensive Calyrex episode, where this set that Brady said, I think Marcus may have built the worst in the worst Calyrex set of all time, carried every <laughs> single game. Yeah, I I retract my statement. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, yeah, it's uh. Does this thing get switcheroo? It's a pretty decent set, like, Be so cool based that. on the, what, how it performed, and you've used it in, like, every other time, like, you've used Calyrex, you've used that You set. know what? No, we shouldn't use this, because <laughs> I'm just looking at it, I'm like, the whole point of running the Steel type was to make sure we don't lose if Trick Room goes up, but the more yeah. I look at it, the more it just does not handle Trick Room. I do think we need a Steel type, though, or something. Yeah. Bro, or uh, or thick fat mon. There's Snorlax. That's true. <laughs> we could do Snorlax. Snorlax does the job. Uh, fine. Okay. You know, I'll I'll give I'll give in to Snorlax. All right. You don't. But only because that. only because Glalie's so bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You you do you don't run uh G, like the G Max, but you just run it to max strike stuff, and then you just have like Curse, Yawn, High Horsepower, Body Slam. Oh, yeah. 
actually body slam is the first move yeah yeah because um max strike is really nice for your like kyogre and stuff and then like you can stall under trick room and then you just run leftovers uh do you have a set for this uh yeah so we hit the first attack bump for attack it's all like 140 and then plus nature oh, okay forgot to run brave brave uh is it at 140 i'm not sure i think 76 investment is the mark so let's do that yeah yeah that is max the first defense. bump max yeah, defense then, yeah and then rest into hp all right i can live yeah, with that right, yeah you know we still kind of yeah. get bopped by a water spout but we you know we got this guy <laughs> Uh, yeah, you got Rillaboom, Aleki, and Akirum. I'm just gonna throw a Rillaboom set that I already had at it. Actually, do we even have a Rillaboom set? I like almost never run Rillaboom. Oh wait, I uh, do. It's just not on this PC, but it's in a DM I have with my girlfriend here. Um, <laughs> yeah, my girlfriend plays VGC. What about it? <laughs> yeah. Ayer, have this Rillaboom set. I'm sure yeah. it'd be very helpful. It's Leah's very cool team. I'm going to block it for everyone else so they can't steal it. You know, it's, it's, it's Leah's team. Um, no yoinking. Yeah, no yoinking. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Uh, Alright, Rillaboom. Alright. Um, Magnet Aleki, I mean, are we just going to run physical? Uh, yeah, oh, like... I think this team wants physical. Wild right. Chuck... I'm just gonna it? steal. <laughs> I'm stealing. Yeah, feel that. <clears throat> yeah, you just gotta change items. Do people run assurance? Uh, do you want to run assurance on this one or just like protect? Um, I guess assurance, assurance is decent for like <clears throat> Kyurga or Regia Lucky lead. It's also like not half bad with Kyurem White. Yeah. yeah. I mean, we have protected on enough Pokemon, don't we? I mean, we actually, no, we dropped it on Kyurem. We yeah, dropped yeah, it yeah. on Kyurem. It feels so weird. Not, Dude, we, you so know what? Not no protect. Any protect. <laughs> no protect. Yeah, no protect. Oh, we, we haven't done any Kyurga. So. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, I don't think I want to run AV Kyogre anymore. <laughs> um, Let's go Mystic Water. Okay. Yeah. Good old I mean, Mystic, Mystic Water. Mystic Water. I'll, like, slap with it. Okay. There we I go. I feel I, safe I, again. I feel safe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we could run Scuff. Um, <laughs> water spout, ice beam, thunder, just like standard BS. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I always, yeah. I always feel weird not having like scald or old pulse in case water spout becomes bad, but then I realize we're playing Dynamax, so uh, yeah. okay. Yeah. I mean, it's just, I don't want to think yeah. anymore. I don't want to think, playing, yeah. When you're when I'm playing timid, when I'm playing tailwind, I always run timid ogre, yeah. Let me run a very quick calc on talent flame because I do want to run. Do we want to run max speed? Like, what's the bump that matters here? Like, what's the investment that'll truly... Oh, you need to hit 194 at least. Or, uh, two, or 200 plus. You want to hit 194 for, uh, at plus one, you run Eleki, I think, or Venusaur. Venusaur, Venusaur. Venusaur, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. 194. Eleki, 186. 184. 194 is Venusaur. So you have to go boosting nature. Yeah. Yeah. It's just hey, cool. We saved one. <laughs> we saved uh, one EV. Do we have to run max oh, attack good. to actually KO Whimsicott? Because yeah. I almost don't want to do that if we don't have to. Um, because we can maybe tank an extra behemoth blade if possible. I don't know. We'll see. Uh yeah, here. Sharp beak, dual wing beat. I come on. It's it's Dynamax. Dual wing beat. The there we go. This the whimsy called it Dynamax. Um, Oh my god, I hate that the calc just breaks when you use dual oh. beat. Oh no, Whimsicott's Dynamaxed. Oh, that makes sense. Still, it just breaks when you use dual oh. beat. Oh no, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it looks like a guaranteed hurricane, like if you look at the text. Where? Oh yeah, I guess it does say that. Listen, I'm stupid and I don't want to think about this. And it, it oh my oh, god, man. it just barely KOs. <laughs> it also yeah, just barely, barely KOs. KOs, that's so dumb. Why can't yeah. you be better? Why? It, you know what, but it's all worth it for the 12... HP we get. Mm. HP. Yeah, that's gonna yeah, matter. Okay. That's totally gonna matter. <laughs> yeah. Okay, everyone's in logged in. Right? Go... Yeah. Uh yeah. And before oh, we okay. uh you know we face another talent flame and we get out sped. <laughs> that could be an issue. What if we face an opposing Kieran White Talent Flame team? Hmm? Dude, mm -hmm. What are the odds? I don't know. What are the odds? What are the odds? What are, what are we naming this? <laughs> what are we naming this? Let's see. Uh, I mean, Brady, come on, you got you got names. Oh, dude, it's it's hyper offense, 
with like a bench it's... warmer. It... <laughs> oh, uh, my my brain's my brain's not working at the moment. Um, hot wings. I don't know. Hot wings. Hot wings. Wings. Hot wings. Hot right. wings. Yeah. Um, chunky hot wings. Chunky hot wings. Let's chunky go. hot. All right. Yeah. No. Uh, yeah. Chunky blue cheese hot wings. There you go. Yes. That's what yes. blue cheese yeah, from. Is it actually blue or is it like blue? I think it's blue. Whatever. I don't know. I, I don't read cheese. Spell it <laughs> like uh, B L U T F T reference. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So let's let's just review the team. We got Sharp Big. Er, sharp Big. Shout out James. Uh, we got Sharp Beak. Uh, <laughs> Shout out to James. <laughs> we got Sharp Beak. <laughs> Gale Wings, Town Flame, Dual Wing Beat, Tailwind, Will O Wisp, Quick Guard. Uh, we got Mystic Water, Kyogre, the set that everyone and their mother runs. We got Life Orb, Curum, White, Turbo Blaze, Helping Hand, because that's going to do something. Uh, Earth Power, Freeze Dry, Drake, a Meteor. We got Physical, Magnet, Reggie, Alecki. Uh, we have our Assault Vest, Rillaboom, and the Tech Leftovers, Thick Fat, Curse, Body Slam, Yawn, High Horsepower, Calyrex counter. Because the only it. thing that this team doesn't want to face is a guaranteed Trick Room plus Calyrex. Yeah. yeah. I'll wait in your marker before we start the video. You have to call the Kyogre this. What are we Bepis. naming the Kyogre? Bepis? Bep naming it Bepis? Bepis. Okay. It all in lowercase. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Oddly specific yeah, yeah. there, but let's, let's do it. Okay. It looks like the Pepsi logo, dude. It does kind of look the Pepsi logo. It's got like the it's got the blue red end, and, and like why it's all it's crazy. We're probably way overthinking this team, considering you know we're playing on low ladder. Maybe a new VGC <laughs> turret will start up soon. We'll just hop in there and just annihilate. Yeah. All, right. <laughs> all right. Okay. All right. Wait. Actually, did this Ooh. team top cut? Um, I remember yeah, seeing it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, like top sixteen. It just kind of it kind of hates Kiram. <laughs> Yeah, just go yeah. Townflame Kyurem. Yeah, Townflame Kyurem. I think... Let's see. Uh, I kind of like a Lecky Beppus. Oh, uh, don't bring both because then we lose to the end game with uh, Rillaboom. Rillaboom, So we bring yeah. Rillaboom plus Suck uh, Ogre. Alright. Yeah. Because um, we want to have something to beat their Rillaboom in the end game. Essentially. Yeah, because Dual Wing Beat's not doing it. Yeah. But I think... um. This Norlox is actually kind of fire. I was running it on Luna Dawn on a serious team with like Charizard, Aleki, and Sin. Yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, oh, they're yeah, probably just they're probably actually. just gonna like light screen, live the hit, and parting shot us. So I kind of don't want to Dynamax just yet and just go for a raw Earth Power. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just Earth Power. I think maybe we just Earth Power the Incineroar, and we could get the Kyogre in right here. Um, yeah. yeah. We can whisk the Grim as well. That's Let's true. just like completely neuter it. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, they I shook. am the fool. I mean, yeah, no, that's matter. fine. It doesn't yeah. matter. All right. Oh, he shook it too. Yeah. All right. Shooka. Does yeah, the next okay. one not even KO? Because what? That did 24. Next one doesn't KO. 24. We do 50. We do 50 next one. Yeah. Um, yeah I think we again still just click it and go for the Wisp. Wisp, yeah. yeah. That way we don't really go down to like a. Okay, we well, didn't spare break to begin with. Yeah. Well, again, right. potting shot it, dude. Oh. Whatever comes in is taking a decent damage. Okay. Uh, turn it or, I mean, it didn't, but. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, uh, we both we're paralyzed. just. We got paralyzed, dude. Yeah. We're just going to get um, Dynamax Cannon here, so. Do um, we, wait, we, do we... sack the Kirim and then max the Rillaboom. Yeah, and then we just we max Quake. Yeah, so let's is... just Earth Power and Tailwind, yeah. maybe. Is this oh, Rillaboom? Yeah. Rillaboom had a uh, knockoff, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Now, I mean, Ooh. this probably doesn't KO, but we definitely eat a hit. Oh, wait, we don't have high horsepower. <laughs> yeah, it's not max. Yeah. Just, uh, or we can do that. Yeah. Um, I think we just I go think... for as much damage as we can. Yeah. And then try to clean not... up. If they brought the... If they even thought about bringing the the Rillaboom, we lose, though. Yeah. Instant comes in, okay. yeah. That's how we play. All right. <laughs> That's Sharp Beak doing wonder. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how much damage that's doing, dude. Okay, okay. all right. I don't hate this, um, but there is an issue. Oh, okay, you're good. Yeah, I mean, we, have, we have Protect. Yeah, we're fine. Yeah, so we just have to Ice Beam the next turn. Okay. Go after Ogre. We're faster? 
Yeah. Oh, not Tellwind. Tellwind, Tellwind. My bad. Yeah. All right, Max Cannon. Um, oh, I let me think. Do we... Ice Balthus, Beam. Darkness, Airs, maybe? I, th I think what we can do, actually, is Darkness and Water Spout, and it should KO yeah. Eternatus. Yeah, 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 that's what I was thinking. Yeah, because they have to sack the Grim here. Oh, it lived. Oh, let's go. All right, one more turn of Tailwind, or is this the last? Uh, that was the last one. Fortunate. And there it is. Okay, I'm, I'm going to do us all a favor. And yeah. We're just going to four of her right there. Yeah. All right. EG. All right, I think uh, if we preserved our Kirim a bit better, it would have worked out. Yeah, and yeah. I, that, that para turn was kind of really bad for us, since we didn't yeah. even really do any damage to the Kirim. Uh, but yeah, uh, Brady, you want to take this next one? Uh, yeah. Oh, we got standard Zashurga. Um, I really like Hiram lead, but at the same time, Zashian like lead could be pretty tough. If they not, so do, do, mean, they, do, do they like end game Zashian or do they? Lead I think they, like they if, if you're playing versus Kiram and you aren't facing Whimsicott, you're facing like Talonflame, you always lead off Zashian, like you, you don't fear it. Like Zashian and been like, hmm. I think we I just go Talon. I, I honestly think we just go Talonflame, cure him, protect Quick Guard, and then attack. Yeah, and then we max Aleki late like, game. Yeah. Yeah. Aleki Rilla in the end seems pretty strong. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Aleki end game against, like, Azashi and Kyurga. Yeah. Honestly, I, I love physical Aleki so much. Like, it's so gross. It's pretty good. The like... extra 10 base power off a wild charge carries it so hard for some reason. <laughs> Oh, yeah, there we go. Those instant, instant Zashian. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they're just gonna. Yeah, we quick guard here because we might take the hit since it's resisted and we have that 12 HP. Uh, yeah, you, you We're just. We're gonna get behemoth bladed. We don't have protect. Yeah. It... Oh, we don't have protect. <laughs> you could. Uh, listen, you could max guard and attempt to. Oh, uh, uh, in quick guard here, but like that's that's rough. I think max guard quick guard is a little rough. Cause we have to we have to preserve that HP for our priority tailwind. Yeah. Let's go for raw tailwind and maybe we can take a bunch of damage on the Rillaboom. Actually no, because we want to preserve our Yeah, let's take a bunch of damage on the Rillaboom. And then yeah, we can Because yeah. Rillaboom's only really yeah. good for the Kyurga. Yeah. And, and then we have and, and, lucky already. And then we just get fake out and we tailwind anyways. Or even Will O Wisp, like Will O Wisp might be better. Yeah. Keep with Blade, we eat that. We eat that. All right. Take out the instant and Tailwind because we yeah. don't want to get burned. Mm -hmm. And then next turn, if we're, you know, still hanging around with Talonflame, we can just Will O Wisp. Yeah. Yep. Let's get it. <sighs> nice. Yeah, Protect. There we go. Protect parting. Yeah. And now it's just free wisp and knock. We don't want to kind of like we want to preserve our positioning with the Rillo Boom, so we can always wood hammer the Kyogre. Yeah, I like that. Um, yeah. yeah, he got the double. Oh, the double. Yeah, that's fine though. If they like whatever they bring out there, we're in a good spot. Also, we burn the Juka, which is really good for us. Yeah, and, and yeah, we still, yeah, we still hold on to Talonflame here. Like, if Ogre comes out, oh, it's Zapdos. It's Zapdos. All right. So here. They're just going to go right back into Incineroar. They're not going to let us burn. Yeah, but let's yeah. We'll go for a Wisp because we don't want them to Airstream plus like their move. And then we can just click. Uh, we can click we can knock off the Zapdos. Knock to off. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, get so rid of. Yeah, yeah this in... is fine. We just don't want to get swept by uh, Zapdos plus Zacian, I guess. Yeah, like that's the we issue. If he Airstreams to next to the Zacian, then we start losing. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Now, um. Now it's just Kyurem time, right? Then right or Kyurem. We can. I want to max the Aleki and try to go for like sweep with Aleki plus Kyurem, hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I, I mean, they don't have. I, I guess um. Uh, Zashin's still on the back, so like Kyurem and Will on our last on a tailwind as well. Yeah. yeah. Um. I kind of. I, I kind of think we go Aleki. And I, I think we have to airstream now, to be honest. And like we hard switch into we hard switch Kira because like if they if they airstream, then we just kind of lose. 
I mean, Aleki is faster than their Mons, so we can always just Lightning and Freeze Dry safely the next turn. So we That's just true. Lightning and swap into Kirum. Yeah, and they need two Airstreams to outspeed us anyways. Yeah, so I just like right. the and swap into Kirum, and then it should be win from there. Yeah. Do we? Do we? Oh, sorry. The the Zapters or the Ensign? The Ensign. We want to yeah. remove the Ensign. Yeah. Because from this range, it might do it. I'm used to Life Orb Calcs. Yeah. yeah. It, most Ensign are Spidef, so and yeah, maybe they have the if they have the Joey X9 version, then it's definitely Spidef. Hmm. Like the the 336 that they always run. Yeah, he runs one five six. All right. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, that's good. Lightning should remove it. That's fine. It's actually better than it didn't remove. Yeah, because now we get to airstream and freeze dry. Yeah. So always, I think, always airstream instant because we want to like at least have the speed and then, Apto should drop realistically, but we still have. I don't know, man. It's freeze dry. Like, yeah, it's Kiram, but it's also freeze dry. I Why trust. Do you trust? I trust it. I, I believe in my buddy Kirim. I'm a, I'm a big hater. No shot. No shot. No. It should. Oh! Let's go! That's actually gross. That's actually <laughs> he's kinda, gross. He's kind of cracked. Right. Okay. Oh. Uh, here's the yeah. issue. If he's scary face... <laughs> you always double the Zashin. Yeah, because he yeah. can't really do much here. So lightning, lightning earth power. Lightning and earth power, yeah. yeah. He went for the light screen. <laughs> he fool. went for the light screen. <laughs> Dude, you, he, fool, you know you what? He, because we crit, he probably thought it mattered. Yeah. <laughs> he probably thought it mattered. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, beautiful. sir. All right. That was that was pretty well positioned. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like that we're thinking and using Kiram. <laughs> it's a high You're not to think. You're not supposed to think. Yeah. Like, uh, turd oh. spotted. Turd well, spotted. Yeah, uh, toad. Kiram food. This is like this is Kiram food. Yeah, I I, I think we literally just Kiram Talon Flame for the third game in a row. Yeah, Kiram yep. Talon Flame Rillaboom. Plus this one's on you, Neil. By the way. Yeah, like. it, this is your game. My game? Yeah, we're rotating. Yeah, this is your game. Okay. We do, we... I am thinking. Let's see. We can go. I want to lead. Yeah, let's lead Talonflame Kirum. It kind of just pressures everything. And then we can play the Rillaboom in the back because they have a Seismitoad and Ogre. And then we can just, instead of running Ogre, just go with the Lucky. Feel it. I'm feeling it. I'm really upset we haven't ran into a Calyrex yet. I want to see the Snorlax do something. Yeah. <laughs> it's mainly for if we run into Palk Cali Ice, the Snorlax will actually just farm it. Yeah. You just yeah. yawn first. It's super free. I never thought yeah. I'd see the day where Thick Fat Snorlax would be more, like, it more viable than Gluttony. Yeah. I think in this format, the Thick Fat Snorlax, it's mostly good on Luna Dawn, in my opinion, because you absolutely farm the Trick Room matchup. It's also just free into, like, Calyrex. Like, it, it, there are so few good normal types in this format that, like, Calyrex Shadow can kind of run rampant. So, like, as soon as it yeah. runs into one decent normal type, it's like, ah, well... My Calyrex is pretty much useless. Yeah. It's like, it's like, it's like P2. Oh, yeah. And oh, wait, like Mark, in DD, I, I guess. To look? Am I supposed yeah, yeah, yeah. to? Yeah. Yeah, well, you're playing. This is your game. <laughs> oh, shoot. Wait, I need to come on. on you're, you're lacking, Neil. You're lacking. <laughs> bro, bro. Where right. is anyone? What was the lead you wanted? You wanted T Flame, Kiram? Kiram, yeah. And then Aleki Rilla. Aleki Rilla, okay. Yeah. No, I thought you guys were clicking, so I was like, I'm a just. Nah, uh... you gotta log in. <laughs> Yeah, my bad. Okay, we go quick guard and we just destroy the Zapdos. Yeah, like that's just absolutely free. <laughs> the yeah. freest, the freest hailstorm I've seen in my life. I guess the only yeah. way this goes wrong is if they end up. <sighs> that Rillaboom is in grassy terrain. Ooh. Yeah. No, we, if we lose. Oh Tom, wait, it's we'll not grassy terrain. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. If we lose Rillaboom, then we just if we lose that whatever Talonflame, then we just bring out the other Mons. So it's yeah. like fine. Oh, yo, he's slower. Okay. He Not only is he slower, but the Rillaboom doesn't have grassy terrain. Yeah, that yeah. that, oh, that, that seems cool. to be a bit of an issue. Let me just go ahead and clean up this match for you. Neil, I'll let you get one more. <laughs> all right, all right. I need to sign in first. <laughs> Wait, do you not protect? The Zacian's going to kill you. There's no shot. Oh, there's no shot. I told you, there's no shot. All right. <laughs> we're, we're playing versus a guy who forgot to run grassy terrain. He also Truth. forgot how how Gale Wings works. Yeah, he he forgot. He forgot. They forgot. They forgot. Right. Cool game. 
Uh, don't worry, we'll give you the <laughs> we'll give it <laughs> we'll give you the grassy terrain. It's okay. Yeah. We're... Damn, and this guy had a cool team. This is like what uh like standard Zashirk was for a little bit. Yeah. At the start. I miss Seismitard. Can we talk about how this Kyogre took a wood hammer? Yeah, you need to be Miracle Seed to like always pick up. Oh yeah, this is just E webs and Earth Power. Yeah. But not E webs. I mean actually, like, like we don't even really need the E web to be honest. Like we're still yeah. faster. There's no shoddy chaos. This thing we just always like You should bounce. I could bounce. I could actually <laughs> bounce. You know what? You? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna bounce. I'm gonna yeah. bounce. I'm bouncing. No! That doesn't matter. Oh wait, can we helping hand bounce it like bounce? And yes. just click helping hand. Let me like, let me earth power. Work. I'm gonna side earth power and bounce this turn and then helping hand the next turn. Alright, yeah. let's do it. No! No! <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that? Alright, he's uh, gonna be close what? combat Rillaboom. <laughs> We're gonna lose. <laughs> Watch out. All right, Excellent now he's for power. Oh my god, I'd be so sad. I, I, that's, no. <laughs> that's so sad. Alright, here, Neil, now it's your game. Yes, and yeah. I am on the account, so now I can play. Alright. Oh, look! Wait, it's no Kyurem switchins? <laughs> no Kyurem switchin'? Hey, this is the six I did pretty well with. Alright, alright, alright. I think into this. Real okay, so I actually run this six a lot. I got it like really, really high. Like I ladder warriored with this. Rillaboom yeah. is actually really good into this. Actually, wait, no, they don't have Yavelto, they have Ogre. Yeah, Rillaboom's free. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm actually just have... I'm straight leading Rillaboom. I want to lead Ileki, because I think that pressures essentially everything. Yeah. And then in the back, I'm thinking about what's optimal. We can just click Tailwind Spout in the end, so let's yeah, do that. Yeah, I mean, like, as soon as the Gastrodon's removed, that's just absolutely free. Yeah, so now we have Rillaboom Aleki, pretty consistent for us, and then we can just, uh... I'm just gonna fake out the Grimmsnarl and just straight lightning the Grim Grimmsnarl as well. Yeah. And essentially, yeah. it's them really well. Do you guys yeah, remember... Do you remember back in the day when Aleki didn't Dynamax? Oh yeah, those the screens, old days. Oh, screens, that, those, double screens. Those were like the times. Thunderbolt. That was that was yeah. when Aleki felt balanced. Yeah, and now I'm just gonna lightning there, Aleki. Actually, I'm gonna airstream and I'm gonna wood hammer. Airstream essentially just offsets them going for their max, and then yeah. wood hammer obviously just blows up the Gastrodon. Yeah, I, I, I run a similar six with Yveltal over the Kyogre, so I kind of know how this team functions. Mm. All right, all right. Wait, yeah. Check it out, he's living. <laughs> no. Yeah, I just saw I just no. saw my health at 86 and I was like, wait. Okay, yeah. yeah. Mean bro. Alright. There we go. Check we it. go one more. We're, we're about to face. Yeah, we'll do one more rotation. We have quite is, a lot of This is the oh, same guy God. that we face. This is the guy who doesn't know how to play the game. Dude, if you you better have your grassy terrain this time. You better have your grassy Hopefully, terrain this time. I'm I'm praying for you. I'm praying for him, dude. Yeah. Um just, you just go, go cure him talent flame again. Yeah, I want to bring a lucky over Kyogre to be honest. I just think yeah. it'd be, I just think it'd be neat. Seismitur doesn't uh, fun fact, Seismitur can't outspeed a lucky. It's like, sad. It like I've never been a Seismitoad fan for that reason. I'm like, if you can't outspeed a lucky at plus two, what are you even doing, Venusaur? I mean the I feel like the the point I think it's fine because like what's a what's an Aleki doing to your uh Seismitur apart from like maybe hitting you with a max strike yeah oh yeah. wait yo you want to see something funny how much you want to bet i can <laughs> ko it without dynamax <laughs> it's just freeze dry it <laughs> and I'm, I'm taking the water spot i'm cure him dude yeah oh he's dynamaxing okay dynamax. well <laughs> damn dude you know sash uh sash size my toad's actually the optimal set i i believe it yeah, because you take Grassy Glide and Max, so you can just airstream. Um, yeah. I'm going to go I mean, I'm gonna go boom I'm here just so I can fake out a Zacian. Yeah. Okay. Does airstream okay. KO Rillaboom? Oh. No. Like a, like a turd airstream? It doesn't KO Rillaboom, does it? Wait, Moxie, Moxie. I think I just Dynamax. The Rillaboom. Yeah, I was going to say, I think I just drum solo yeah. here. Yeah, drum solo like for the win. Yeah, and then you can uh, spam max strike since you're faster than the Zacian, and then you basically put your end game in a position where you guarantee win. You know what's insane? Mm. Max strike 
is the only move in the game that retains value despite being so, like ma as far as max moves go it retains its value despite being such a low base power half the time since it's always off of like fake out in the moment we introduced a pokemon that has a high base power max strike like you know like regigigas it just got absurd yeah i wonder if they swap their ogre into zashin i don't like i don't even think it matters like they don't take this yeah helping hand drum solo just KO the next turn we haven't clicked that yet. I'm just gonna click it now. Why not? Let's do it. I'm gonna click it. Now. Actually, no. I'll, I'll just do it. I'll just do it next turn. Yeah. I'll Let's just check the boom. We actually could lose if we don't. Yeah. 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 Right, yeah. Now we get to click the funny move. Let's see if this chaos. Yeah. Let's do it. I think right, it does. Right, There's no shot this doesn't. It's two oh wait with a helping hand. Oh, it didn't. Oh yeah, well, no. that's why. <laughs> oh, wait. Let's see if it does twenty five. Oh, crit. oh uh, what if crit. Crit. yeah okay that would have been nasty unfortunately for our opponent though he has lost yeah yeah just put him right here drop the well charge with the combination of either yeah well charge will pick up i mean i could bounce yeah, like, you know but if we're real we bounce a <laughs> real one's snare <laughs> but we bounce <laughs> dude yes yeah, there we go. Hi, there bradley we're going for another? Yeah, Bradley, you get you got this, you got this. Alright. What? What am I looking at? I think I faced this in a room tour. No, I didn't. Mm -hmm. Why are you running Zamazenta with no Thunderous? What's going on here? Alright. Um hmm. I I mean I feel like Curum, like we just need it because like Goshadron, Zapdos, uh, Urshifu. Oh, we're not, we're not fast enough, Urshifu. Um, hmm. Goshadron specifically, uh, in Sin as well. I'm kind of uh, concerned. As well. I'm kind of <laughs> concerned that Zamazenta actually takes a Max Quake. It really does. It does, it does. All the right. thing about that, though, is, like, we can also Will-O-Wisp it, maybe. Uh, it's, because... Uh, because Talon Flame walls it, and... Yeah, I, I Flame Kyrum for the eighth game in a row. Yeah, yeah. uh, <laughs> we could, I guess, I guess... I, I guess Wajioleki isn't too bad either. I guess it's just the Gushadron we really gotta worry about. We did drop Assurance, though. That's kind of concerning for the Calyrex matchup. Yeah, um... Hmm. I mean, we have Rillaboom for that as well. We are or AV. Wait, Snorlax doesn't really do much, he's does it either. Hmm. I'm like not sure what to lead. Um Regieleki. Listen, if there's anything we learned, we need to stop thinking. Okay, I'm gonna lead Talonflame Kirim with Regieleki in the back. Uh what what drew in back? Uh, uh I would say Kyurga Rilla. Or... Rilla or Kyurga, yeah. Rilla Rilla cause it deals with everything that Kyogre would have, but also doesn't lose to Gastro. Yeah. Well, I guess it doesn't deal right. with, you know, Incineroar, but... Yeah. Incin. Oh, it's, oh, it's water? water? Hello? Ooh. Okay, so this is free. So what you've told me is this is free, because <laughs> we... Oh, wait, we're not faster than Urshifu. Dang it. So we do have Ooh. to... I mean, do you want to just failed? Willow... I, I mean, we could just Will-O-Wisp Urshifu and go for the Freeze Dry on Gastrodon, and then Tailwind next yeah. turn, because we're going to eat the hit from Urshifu. Yeah... This is like some weird stuff going on here. He Dynamax the yeah. Gastrodon. It's Max Aqua Jet. Dude, All right, no, Dude, no what? shot. He lives this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What's well, um, on? yeah, I think I think we win. Uh, I think that. One, wait, doesn't Surging Strikes hit it three times? It would have gotten. Would have done more. Yeah. Why didn't you Surging Strikes? Wait, does it does it do three hits then? Oh, they, uh, did they leave? No. I think I, I actually don't know how that interacts with Storm Drain. I would imagine it does it. I I don't think it does, or else they would have done it. Mm. Or oh, that's like why we're confused. Like yeah. if it did do it, they might have done might. it to avoid like I don't know getting KO'd by Hurricane or something. <laughs> Golf Kieran. Actually, no, because it because Hurricane still would have gone first. Okay, it's Calyrex Shadow, everyone. Yay! Okay, uh, just Tailwind, it's Max Hailstorm. Yeah, it's just this, this is the free one. <laughs> yep. Oh, do, is it not technically uh, more optimal to go for a Max Wormwind just to uh, actually? Uh, Hailstorm no, covers for Sash. Sash, Sash, bro. Ah, uh, oh. true. Yeah. 
Also, there I don't think they're even in the battle anymore. Yeah, this might be. Oh, let's. I'm gonna. I'm gonna put on like royalty free music while we speed up this battle. Right. Oh, he is in the battle. Yeah. No, I. The I, I. The reason why I said maybe wind is better because yeah, yeah dude, Urshifu, Urshifu water's damage output is disgustingly disappointing. Yeah, you need a. It's actually like if you play a proper positioning game and just start spamming surging strikes at the right moments, you can slowly trip everything. And then you get like an airstream boost onto it. It's really good. Yeah, it's just hard to do it. I thought it was a lot better in, when with like no max in series ten. Mm. Oh, dude, Urshifu was busted. Then like you just you just you just like click double fake out surging strikes. You just clean. All, All right, right. hear me out. Hear me out. Quick guard to flex on the Urshifu. <laughs> Do yeah, it, do quick it, do it. Uh, <laughs> Okay. Well, I mean, I'm I'm a little disappointed we didn't get to use the the snow axe at all, but um, we learned something today, uh, and that's Kurum White players deserve no love and affection, um, <laughs> <laughs> and and uh, hyper offense is fun. Like I, I don't know. Like usually there's like a I wouldn't say there's a moral to the story, but we learn something at the end of each at the end of each video, and I don't think we learned much today. We just used hyper offense. Yeah, we learned that hyper offense is disgustingly easy. Sometimes not the greatest. Uh, and uh, Kurum. And Kurum. Kurum. Yeah. And Kurum. Joe, um, comment down below if you're watching. Uh, but yeah. Uh, <laughs> Uh, that's gonna be it for this video. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe. I know we played on low ladder, unfortunately, that happens when we had to make a new account. You know, I would have preferred to play this at high, but it's, it's whatever. Uh, but yeah, if you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe. Subscribe to Neil, subscribe to Brady, both their links are in the description down below. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye. Bye.